Today I'm going to be turning a lovely young man into Marilyn Monroe. The first thing I need to do is block out his eyebrows. I do a few layers of glue and powder to block the eyebrows down. And then I'm going to foundation the entire face. I'm going to color match him and make his skin look even and flawless like Marilyn's. And then we're going to contour and highlight with a darker color than normal because he has such strong bone structure. I want to make him a little bit more feminine. Then I move on to the eyebrows. I use a cream to do the original shape, set it with powder. and then I use a dark eyebrow powder to give the look of hair strokes in the eyebrows to make it look as natural as possible. I then use bronzer and blush and contour his cheeks and his nose a little bit more to make them more feminine. Next, I'm gonna add the iconic Marilyn Mole. Very simple eyeshadow, matte whites and nudes, just to kind of give that bedroom eye. I then need to add eyelashes. While the glue is drying, I'm going to outline the lips. Fill it in with a beautiful red lipstick. I'm gonna finish off the look with a little mascara. Finally, the piece de resistance, the iconic wig. Are you ready? As ready as I'll ever be. Okay. Oh, I look so much like Marilyn Monroe. I look... <laughs> I think my mom's gonna be really proud. I mean, you make a pretty girl. It's great, it's wonderful. You've got perfect Marilyn eyes, for sure. Perfect Marilyn eyes. He had beautiful almond-shaped eyes, very reminiscent of Marilyn. Great bone structure. I think Marilyn Monroe proves that no matter what, you can feel sexy, you can feel beautiful, and that's what matters. Happy birthday. Mr. President, happy birthday to you. I'm so sorry, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>